yes, today we're, our recipe is very, I think it's going to be really good. It is sesame shrimp ball. Guys, I'm being serious today. The, ingre <laughs> <laughs> the ingredients we have today for this are chopped green onion, chopped ginger, chopped garlic, sweet peppers which are red, green, orange and yellow, chopped onions, sesame seeds, egg, Japanese breadcrumbs, chopped shrimp, soy sauce, black pepper, seed and salt. Blah, blah, blah. You just said blah, blah, blah. I didn't say what? Ah, okay. Let's just go on to the thing. No! So now we're going to make the mixture. Bavin, are you ready? Yes. Yes. Not touching each other. So we have chopped shrimp. If we peel the tail out. And now we can put this in here. What type of shrimp? And this is a... 2125. The reason why it's called 2125 is. I know, I know. Yes. Well, I don't know where you're asking oh, me. Oh, okay. <laughs> the reason it um, says 2125 is because if, if you get 21 to 25 shrimps, it makes one pound. Hey, I know that. I, for, um, okay. But where did you get this information? You know, I get information every day. Um, I'm asking from who? From me. Okay. Just sounds awkward. <laughs> so you have to mix the shrimp gently. So now we can put the onions. Okay. Okay. Let's mix it gently. Okay. After some time, we can put sweet pepper. Oh. Wait, right now. At least it's not pepper. My also will burn my eyes if you put it like <laughs> that. Okay. After some time, we can put the garlic a little bit time later. Top garlic. garlic. Yeah. Oh. Okay. I guess we can put the garlic now. It's going to be fun. The shrimp is so cold. Okay. okay, I have to mix it softly because we don't want the vegetables to not get inside because we have to let it stick. So we can put the green onions. Okay, stop putting it on my hand or else it's going to be sticky like gecko, spider man. Okay, we have to put ginger, top ginger. Okay. For the egg and the Japanese breadcrumbs, we have to put it a little bit later because if we put it so quick, it wouldn't be good. So we have to be careful by with the egg and the Japanese breadcrumbs. Isn't it? Yes. Let's put salt. Yes. Before salt, we salt. put the egg, we have to put um, salt and black pepper plus the soy sauce. That the um, a little bit more. We need some taste because there's like a lot in there. That should be good. Now black pepper. I can't see it. Okay, good. We can put a little bit of soy sauce. Not a lot because we don't want or else it will be bitter. You're not playing. Okay. You just so have to shake it up. <laughs> yep, we figured it out. Okay, the color came on this. This egg and Japanese breadcrumbs are like lazy people. They come really late. Late, yeah. Now we can put the egg. Do I have to touch the egg? <gasps> oh, yes. That's the big thing. Isn't it? Yeah. At least I have gloves for my protection. Yes. Okay, it's half of the breadcrumbs. A little bit. Good. The reason why we put um, bread, Japanese breadcrumbs and egg is because that we need the binding. The binding. In, in the um, shrimp plus the vegetables because it gives us more flavor play and crispiness. Leave the fly.
Because it flies. What am I supposed to do? Guys, the mixture is ready. Look at that. It's all binding with Ew. the soy sauce and the color. Now we're going to make it into the ball. Ooh, that's going to be a good one. In a spare shape. Okay. Bavin, I guess you can help me. Thanks. I okay. haven't worked for a long time. You're lazy then. Dude, stop seeing that. Okay. This is sticky. Yeah, it is sticky. So guys, look at this ball shape. Let's put it in the plate. Mm. I have to get a little bit bigger size to stick it together. So guys, um, the binding and the mixture came out good. And if it still break, add more um, breadcrumbs. Bread, Japanese breadcrumbs. So let's make the um, mixture of the, the, of the sesame seed um, and the breadcrumbs, the Japanese breadcrumbs. We have to mix it. Mix it up. You're mixing me up. Okay, we have to spread it everywhere. Good. Now we are able to put the um, shrimp balls into this. Shrimp. Just have to roll it up. As you see, the um, sesame seed are sticking in this. As you see, and this would, I'm sure, I'm think, I'm sure, I'm think, thinking that. This would give us a better taste. I have never tasted shrimp ball. Oh. So guys, we are like finished um, coating this with the Japanese breadcrumbs and the sesame seed. So now we just have to make it back into a spare shape. Look what happened. There's yeah. a crack. Whatever. But it's still, when we put it into the um, frying pan or the oil, it would just stick together doesn't matter yes so we just have to rotate it and rotate right to left up okay. and down let's just do this look at these these looks okay because those um sesame seeds sticks in there with and i'm sure that sesame seeds are good for your body it is yeah okay we're done guys i think i try the shrimp ball Okay, let we have to wait for the golden brown color. Okay, we have we can put four at a time right now. For this one, for this one. Yeah. If you have a bigger one, you can put about any. How it fits? How it's about to fit? Does it have three in there? Yes. Be careful. Don't drop it. Okay. We have to wait for the golden brown color, as I said. Okay. Or else it means that it isn't cooked. We need that color because that color always tells us that yes. it's cooked. So we have five here left and the next and next time is eating. How, how is it possible he gets his best food? Yes, shrimp boy. Hi. As you see, look at the color. It's fully finished. So we can take it out. The golden brown color came. I just okay. let the strain strain the oil because we don't want oil in this. Oil. Okay. Yeah. Good. You can literally see okay, those you can put the next five seeds. The sesame seeds you can see outside. Look at this one at, for example. This one's good. Look at this. It you can see the, those tiny tiny sesame seeds. They Be are careful. Some. Okay, the last one we're putting in here. Congratulations, we finished. Yay. It's finished when you take it out. Yes, that's So guys, um, the other set is ready. Now we can take it out. Let's strain it. The oil has to come out from everything. Okay, now we can put this here. Happy birthday to you. Happy it's no one's birthday. As you see, the bubbles popping out. And look at these ones. Look, it looks like those crust that comes out from a chicken sandwich, Yo, and it turns out they're like dripping the same. oil. Whatever. They're dripping oil. So, by the way, this is done. So let's arrange this. First.
first let's turn this off and let's go and arrange it. Oh, over here. Oh, this. Whoa. Warning. Okay. Let me put it. It's not hot that much because I'm having long gloves. Gloves are not special. For me, they are. For you, I guess. Yeah. It's done! Well, hi! Welcome back to Taste Time. Today we're going to be tasting sesame shrimp balls. Be quiet, I'm having a nap here. Why is that mosquito hitting me? Hey, stop that. <sighs> okay. Hi guys, I didn't miss anything. I know what I'm doing. Okay, let's go and cut some sauce here. Let's put it right there. Okay. Dude, why did he put it in the potato? So I can have, and uh, let's get the um, shrimp ball. Dude, let me take it. Go, take it out. Disturbing. Okay, and I'm going to dip this with chili, sweet chili sauce. You can have this with um, hot sauce, wasabi sauce, or any sauce that suits you. So let's go and have a taste, buddy. You didn't even start. Does this fit me? Okay, whatever. I'm going to taste before him. Yeah. No! I'm taking my time. Delicious. I need more. Ooh. Okay. Uh, do I want to get another piece? No, I don't. You I'm didn't even finish a piece. Other time. I guess this would be my belly time snack. As it is. Whoa! This is awesome. Dude, Delicious. chill down, chill down, sit down first. How was your taste? I just said it. Okay, it was awesome for me and delicious. I don't know if I'm hoping this looks like a lunchtime, um, a lunchtime or a snack time for you. But you can have this as a cocktail snack and a dinner. But this is nothing for me. This is a belly lunch for belly time for me. How was how was yours? Okay, okay, that's weird. Mm -hmm. You know, this is a full year snack for me. Okay, that is really weird, guys. And I hope you like this video. And hit a like on this button. I mean, hit the like button. Subscribe and hit the notification bell. The shrimp notification bell. Really? <laughs> Not the shrimp, guys. The shrimp boy notification bell. And give us a feedback. Try this at home. We'll see you in the next video. Let me go back to sleep. Bye! And thanks for being with us. We're in taste time. He woke me up.